GamesWeasel.com Review I've never heard of the original 99 Nights, but you don't need to have played the first game to understand what's going on in this sequel. Basically, it's the usual fantasy story of an evil army horde invading and you being the good guys trying to stop it. Along a similar vein to the Dynasty Warriors games, you fight thousands of enemies as one of five lone combatants as you hack and slash heads and limbs off your enemies to get to the other side of the level. And these levels are large and take a while to get through, so it's also a shame there's no way of saving mid-level if you do need to turn off your console unexpectedly at any point. So, playing as humans, elven maids and big beasts, you mash the normal and heavy attack buttons and bust out some magic now and then to clear a load of enemies at once or use a special ability to block barriers or flick switches that block your way. And then occasionally you'll fight a boss that will prove very difficult to beat after you've been used to wading through all the dumb enemies you've encountered on the way there. My problem with these types of games is they don't seem to actually be that much fun. Sure you can upgrade your characters and find collectibles throughout the maps but there doesn't seem to be any wow factor as you slice everyone up. Since games such as Devil May Cry and Bayonetta have proved you can kill with style and finesse, this just seems plain average. It doesn't do anything particularly badly, it's just there's nothing at all which stands out and makes me want to keep playing. There is a multiplayer mode though if you fancy it, but to be honest, you're only going to want to play this game if you really, really like Dynasty Warriors and are holding out for the next one in that series. 99 Nights 2 gets an average 5 out of 10 been watching a review from Games Weasel. If you want to get the show each week, which includes video game reviews, news, previews, competitions and special features, then head over to gamesweasel.com for our video podcast, Games Weasel TV. Gamesweasel.com